Hey, what's everybody? It's Christian Street here in Hempstead, New York. So we're going to review. These are the reverse 406s. Uh, the shoe comes out June 8th. The box price is 200 the color on the box is white black, simple. Um, and also, look, I said the little speckle on the, on the paper inside, as far as also, and also the also the area of print. Um, yeah. They have a little storm going on outside, so it might be a little bit noisy. Um, okay, so just a brief history on, on the six. 1991, the shoe comes out. It's Tinker Hatfield shoe. Uh, Mike wanted an inventive way as far as how he wanted his number put on the shoe, and I thought it was pretty cool how they did it. Um, I can probably show you better here. You can see the two lay, uh, on the heel back here, and you can see the three laying down. So it's kind of hidden in plain sight, which I thought was a pretty unique, inventive idea. So that's how the 23 was on the shoe. Also, Mike liked the touch of his cars. Influence, I mean, on the on his shoe, and this came from that Porsche. Um, it was called the Duck. It had a big giant spoiler on the back, and that's what this pull tab is from. So that's from this car. So uh, yeah, that's the that's the history on it. Um, like I said, these are the reverse Oreos. Now the Oreo Six, I re I re did review it in 2010. I also reviewed um, the Motorsport Sixes, which I think this resembles a lot. If you look back at the video, you see that Motorsport Six. Um, but these are the reverse. Oreo. The splatter print here is the same here on this reverse as it was on the original or on the non-reverse. Non this is the same as well. The only difference is this is black here, which is not that much of a difference. It was um, splatter print on that, on the Oreo. Now the Oreo also had the, the black new buck here on the toe box side panels. So it gave the shoe a big contrast. It was a, it was a nice looking shoe. I, I really liked that. Um, Oreo 6, how that was done. This is very nice, very clean. Uh, it's, a good, you know, it's a nice way of doing it. They did a, on the bottom, they reversed it. Uh, this was a black jump mat. This white went to black, and this black here went to white, which is on the bottom. You, you really don't see it that much, but this, um, you know, the shoe, like I said, it was, uh, it's clean. Like I said, it wasn't that much of a reverse, I don't think. So maybe it shouldn't even been really been called a reverse Oreo, but um, it's still a good looking shoe, and, and, and I do like it. The build quality is really nice. Like you can see how everything is done. The seams are perfect. I don't see the blue stains. I mean, this is it's really really nice done, nicely done. You, but you've got a white jump in inside right there. Yeah, no, I, I definitely like this shoe. It's definitely clean. Um, cool, cool looking shoe. Like I guess that it could have been a little bit more for the reverse naming it that way, but. It's still, it's still, I can't hate the shoe and I'm not going to take away from it. So it's still a good looking shoe. Um, yeah, I've got a couple hats and this is easy to hook up. Oh, my Long Island hat that I would still want. This is black and white. That's any Yankee hat just to go with it. Pretty, pretty easy shoe to, to, to hook up with. Uh, the next shoe I'm going to review is the Jordan 4. It's the oxidized green. It looks a more like an emerald green. Um, I'm going to review that one and I'll try to put, um, Maybe I'll wait till next week. So I'm getting another Valabasas. I get my spring for the clothing to show you my clothing. I have a whole line of Valabasas clothing. Behind me, I have some Godspeed in. These are Godspeed tees that come in. I've got a, another whole grouping coming in next week. So maybe when I do that uh, retro four review, I can show you the Godspeed the new set, and I also have that whole line of Valabasas shorts t-shirts. Really, really nice look up. So I just want to let you know this way, but so guys want to see what else we have in the store. Um, you know. So um, that's it. Yeah, so just take your last look at these reverse Oreo 6s. Streak your out.